Well, how's everybody doing today? Today is about my dry kiln and the slabs that I cut for it. Anyways, I'll show you the dry kiln. It's a school bus. We're turning it into a dry kiln and in the front here, I'll set up my woodpecker slab fattening mill. And the back here is gonna be the dry kiln. So it's coming along. It's all the gaps are spray foamed. Everything's foamed. Everything's being insulated. This is the back chamber that uh, dehumidifies everything and uh, pulls the water out of everything. So this will be all sealed. Okay. So this is the kiln. Hi, Bo. Give you guys another view of it. So I'll be able to dry 12 foot lumber, no problem. Anyways, that's it. And then I'll show you why I'm building it. We just, uh, I cut up all these. So I got all these slabs to put in. I'll fill it all up with uh, the ash and the birch. So these are some nice slabs I cut. All right? Lots of live edge figured. And then you get into the crotch stuff. And this is all crotch. There's like five tables. I'd move them, but there's too much wood to move. It's too heavy. And then you get into all this live edge. And then this beautiful stuff here with the good colors. Sorry about that. Tripped and fell. Anyways, that's my pile. And that'll all go in the mobile dry kiln. And I cut it all up with the little mill on there. And I still got all this to cut. So I'll be able to fill it. I, this is all birch. It's all spalted. It's been down for two years. All the stuff on the bottom. And this is all fresh ash. And then I got these big slabs here. They're over four feet wide. So I'll be cutting them with the power saw mill. And that'll be another video. But you guys can follow along and watch as I uh, finish off the kiln and uh, get it loaded. Have a good day, everybody. Follow along in the future videos. Subscribe, give me a like, comment, get back to you. Have a good day. Bye.